Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a remarkable demonstration of solidarity with Ukraine, the Netherlands, in collaboration with Denmark and Germany, unveiled plans on April 15, 2024, to procure RQ-35 Hydron Unmanned Aerial Vehicles, UAVs, totaling 200 million euros for delivery. This significant decision follows an extraordinary assembly of the drone coalition, comprising Great Britain, Latvia, Denmark, Estonia, Lithuania, Canada, the Netherlands, Germany, and Sweden. During this pivotal gathering, Canada pledged to transfer 450 Skyranger air defense systems to Ukraine, commencing this summer. Moreover, Lithuania allocated 3 million euros towards the production of first-person view, FPV, drones for Ukrainian forces, while Germany committed to transferring 211 vector reconnaissance drones. These commitments underscore the coalition's collective strategy to bolster Ukraine's defenses against Russian aggression, echoing sentiments voiced by Ukraine's Deputy Minister of Defense, Katerina Chernogorenko, and Latvian Defense Minister Andrus Spruds. The procurement of RQ-35 reconnaissance UAVs represents a further testament to the Netherlands' steadfast support for Ukraine, bringing their total assistance to 3 billion euros for the upcoming year. In March 2024, Defense Minister Kaisa Ollengren, following a meeting of the Contact Group on Defense of Ukraine, announced the Netherlands' intention to procure aviation weaponry for F-16 fighter jets earmarked for Ukrainian forces. Building upon this commitment, Dutch Prime Minister Mark Rutte disclosed in April 2024 an additional 1 billion euros in military aid, coupled with 400 million euros allocated for the country's post-conflict reconstruction efforts. The impending arrival of RQ-35 drones is poised to meet the expectations of Ukrainian armed forces, with previous reports lauding the efficacy of the RQ-35 Hydron in combat scenarios. Manufactured by the Danish company Skywatch, these UAVs boast advanced capabilities tailored for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance ISR, missions. Notably, Skywatch engineers have iteratively enhanced the UAV's resilience to electronic warfare and its navigation capabilities in Global Navigation Satellite System GNSS, challenged environments, drawing from operational insights garnered in Ukraine. The RQ-35 Hydron represents a fixed-wing mini unmanned aerial system UAS, purpose-built for low-altitude video surveillance and reconnaissance operations. Equipped with a triple-lens camera system encompassing visible and thermal imaging modalities, the Hydron can relay live video feeds across distances exceeding 30 kilometers, fostering real-time situational awareness. It boasts an impressive flight endurance of up to 100 minutes, coupled with a maximum wind tolerance of 12 meters per second and a service ceiling of 5,200 meters above sea level. The camera payload platform features stabilized gimbals, facilitating optical zoom capabilities ranging from 20x to 40x, complemented by additional digital zoom functionalities. Additionally, secure data transmission is ensured through radio frequency transmissions operating within the 2.2 to 2.5 GHz spectrum. The acquisition of the RQ-35 Hydron UAVs signifies a pivotal milestone in the ongoing collaboration between the Netherlands, Denmark, and Germany in bolstering Ukraine's defense capabilities. As geopolitical tensions persist in the region, this concerted effort underscores the unwavering commitment of the international community to uphold Ukraine's sovereignty and territorial integrity. That's all for now. See you later.